Yeah, back here they say shoulder let's have a look today on the Fiesler FI 103 AB or V1 rocket of course. Um, I already showed you the unboxing of this model and also I think the manual guide but what was uh, I was something forget to say so uh, because uh, you can uh, make uh, two versions from this uh, rocket thing you can also uh, of course uh, show like this when he's flying and lying on his trailer and <laughs> you can make it like this we have we, we have the wings of those rockets and place them on both sides of this uh, framework with the wheels for uh, transportation and um, so that was I was, was forget to say it last time I built it and I must say it's an absolutely great little rocket it's a great thing uh, the fit form is good and everything the, um, this is the first time that I uh, wanted to say I wish I had airbrush because if you can say I painted the whole thing with my pen with my pencil <laughs> with the, with the paint and uh, the pencil uh, yeah okay <laughs> you get the idea um, and uh, the scale of course is 1 to 32 and that's absolutely great but it also works with the 1 to 35 scale models if you can see we have the Ketten Karat He's transportation, uh, he's driving the rocket to his launch or something, we don't know. The thing is lying loose on this frame so you can al also hang it uh, with some... Uh, with a rope on, on, the, uh, on the ceiling or something when it's in flight mode or so, what you want. Uh, there's a little bit of stickering if you can see. The swastika of course is not in the kit, but um, yeah. Uh, I had some uh, views on uh, YouTube, I saw some videos on YouTube of course from the real thing, the real uh, uh, V1 and uh, you also see some uh, pro prototypes, some, some types with the swastika on it and I thought well listen, I will see, oh my god I gonna do that and it's maybe a little bit childish, okay I, know, I, uh, I, I give you right, I absolutely do but I like that yeah, not the thing itself, but uh, the uh, authentical history. <laughs> uh, uh, how do you call it? Thing. No. you get the ideal uh, idea. Um, nicht auftreten steht da drauf. Do uh, you cannot uh, walk uh, on it or sit on it and go to fly in the air or something? No, it's not a, not an um, aircraft, but the, the building is look like, uh, of course, a lot. It looks like an aircraft to me also how you build it uh, so the, the painting is the most work if you can see the camouflage scheme we have uh, a lot of um, examples in the manual guide for uh, form ways to uh, to make it and if you can see I uh, used um, a little bit the box art and also uh, what's on, on the uh, in the manual guide of course but uh, you can see it I'm not a great um, uh, painter and uh, if you have this thing, use an airbrush, I recommend that. Or, uh, well, or don't. <laughs> you can see some stickers, of course. Some red is in on it, with some text. Um, they're also uh, built in pieces in the real thing. That's, it's like a huge Meccano dose box. Also, the, the flying, uh, how do you call it, the round thing is in it. You can see it no more because it's in the, in the bomb but uh, you get the idea of course we have the framework we have four wheels on it and we have two carrying pieces also on this side but I have to uh, I had to remove that I don't didn't like that and uh, I used the cat grass of course or, or a tank or what the hell you wanna wanna put in front of the flying thing well it's a new kit from 20 from this year so that's a really absurd lies and I was very happy I, happy. I bought this thing for 20 euros a little bit maybe too much but uh, well I am uh, very excited uh, to see this end result of this uh, flying thing it's, um, fits, it fits really good with the other rocket I have the V2 of course there it is so you can use this thing really good for um, for dioramas or something or whatever you want okay I hope you enjoyed it next time other stuff but uh, well leave a comment or not uh, join my Facebook of course www.facebook.com for more uh, stuff uh, 
Okay, goodbye. See you next time. Goodbye.